Well, some big changes are coming to the NFL next year with the league changing how opening kickoffs are going to work and banning a certain kind of tackle to prevent injuries. We caught up with Byron Native and eight-year NFL veteran Sean Considine to hear his perspective on the new rules and how it might impact current players. Big changes are coming to the NFL on both defense and special teams. The biggest change coming on defense is the ban on the hip drop tackle, a move the NFL has cited to cause 20 to 25 more injuries than other kinds of tackles. While the change is polarizing to many, eight-year NFL veteran Sean Considine has always viewed it as a dangerous play. I think it is an actual technique that some guys just kind of get into a bad habit of doing, and it is very dangerous. I mean, when you see it happen on a football field, you you know that somebody's probably getting hurt. This tackle on Mark Andrews is an example of the hip drop. Andrews left the game with an ankle injury and missed the rest of the regular season. The NFL has made countless changes to how defense can be played in the last decade to help player safety, but Considine says this latest adjustment is insignificant compared to others made in the past. The brand of football that's played at the NFL right now compared to what it was even 10 years ago is significantly different. Um, I think that was a bigger transition than what this is going to be with this hip drop thing. I think this is, you know, not as it's it's more rare for this this situation to come up. The other change coming this season is a completely new kickoff system the league adopted from the XFL. In the new kickoff, only the kicker and two returners will be allowed to move until the ball is either caught or hits the ground, bringing a lot more action to a side of the game that's been forgotten over the years. It should be a meaningful play in a football game. Um, when every kickoff's going through the end zone because these NFL kickers can kick the ball that, that well, you know, it just kind of makes it almost a, a waste of everybody's time. Considine credits his long NFL career to his ability to perform on special teams. The 2012 Super Bowl champ hopes these changes can once again give players a chance to carve out a role on their NFL teams. Um, a lot of the rule changes that have come up about, especially in the special team stuff, is real has really changed the game it, and you know I think it would have made it harder for a guy like myself to you know to play a few extra years in the NFL because you know they, they moved the kick up the kickoff up five yards almost every kickoffs in the end zone now I mean you very rarely see a kick return I mean think about you just got Devin Hester in the Hall of Fame I mean the days of having great kick returners are probably over because they don't get an opportunity to return anymore and hopefully this new kickoff rule can bring back the electric type of returners that we've seen in the past like Hester. The rule will be in place for a one-year trial period before the owners make another vote next offseason.